Hey, welcome back to my house. Last time on Octopath Traveler 2, we arrived in Ors Rush, a quaint little town that started the silver business. And we met Particio the Merchant, who is recounting us the story of this rise and fall of this little venture, owing to man's worst nightmare, the fine print in the contracts. This time, we need to go buy our dad medicine with the pennies we still got after a thing that looks got crashed into the dirt. So this medicine's in a tavern. Well, don't you look familiar. Only a hundred. I can make this purchase. It's like market price to me. You have yourself a deal. Thank you kindly. I swear if that medicine kills him on sight. Hey, boys. Howdy there, fellas. Getting on well? Boss, got any work for us? None of us have had a job for days. We can't even afford a decent meal. This town's done for. We've lost everything. Gotta find a way to make this last measly crust of bread keep me going. Hey, boss. Got a job for me? Any job? Man, things are really rough here. Sorry, uh, I want to hire you, but I don't got the leaves. It's hard to make a living with that silver mine now. The landowners' laws are squeezing us dry. Damn. What are we supposed to... Mm -hmm. Harry, that's my crust. Give it back. Shut up. I'm taking it. I've got mouths to feed, too. That's enough. Man. Here, y'all split my bread. It ain't much, but it'll tide you over. Boss... I... Even in the worst of words, he's really willing to part with anything he has just to keep his friends happy. <sighs> Damn. Sorry, Harry. Sorry, Nikki. It's my fault you're suffering. You know what I recommend? Beating up the landowner. If only I could make things better. If only I could look out for you. Never imagined it'd end up like this. I never knew what a devil poverty was or how much pain it could bring. And he's crying. Don't worry about it. We'll figure out something to do for work. Boss, it's not your fault. Damn, you're pathetic. Look at you cry! Oh boy. Now stop with the waterworks and pony up the leaves, bucko. Gif. As if today couldn't get any worse. Smart of you to toady up to that leech of a landowner. The most important thing in life is figuring out whose side to take, bucko. You haven't forgotten that contract from 16 years back now, have you? A merchant like you should understand the power of a flimsy piece of paper. What do you want, Gif? I got a message from our benevolent landowner. Tax on silver's going up. Lucky you. Son of a bitch. A lot of competition in the silver trade lately. Or prices are going down, down, down. Hurts the boss's kindly old heart to do this. But times are tough. Okay, now I really want to beat up the landowner. You think we'll stand for that? You ain't getting another leaf out of us. Yeah, we're all struggling just to eat. Hmm, getting rebellious, eh? In this world, there are those who squeeze, and those who get squeezed. 
You idiots are glad. You're nothing but lemons to me. Your job is to get squeezed into lemonade. You... you... Though, uh, none of you can afford to buy lemons anymore, can you? <laughs> you piece of shit. Yeah. Listen up, bucko. Next time I come to collect, I'm taking a bigger cut. Boss. Damn it! I need to get back home. Nothing else I can do about this. Oop, I'm stuck. What do you have? Let's just get in. Hope Dad's alright. He's sound asleep, huh? Alright. Oh, I had to place it here. Hey, Pops. Uh, I'm back. <coughs> Something happened? I've never seen you look so dispirited. Uh, nothing. Nothing at all. Particio. I won't pretend to know what's got you down. But here's a word of advice. Why not just go for it? Do whatever it is you want to do most. <sighs> you'll never lose if you never try, son. But you'll never win either. Huh. <sighs> that settles it. Please tell me we're going to go beat up the landowner now. I'll be back in two shakes of a cates, Whisker Pops. Thanks for the advice. <laughs> Kid's face lit up like a miner's lantern. <sighs> it's all over for us. Uh, they're gonna squeeze us until we're dry as the desert sand. Fellas, listen up. You wanted a job, and I got one for you. Let's send those leeches packing. Yeah. You mean it? I've been holding back ever since they took our deed away from us. We've all suffered in silence. Now, well, I finally understood. That dastard landowner, well, only thing on their mind is how to grow rich and fat off our toils. They don't care a whit about what happens to us or our town. That's why we gotta take it back, and our lives with it. He actually cracked his knuckles. Oh, that's... I'm with you, boss. This is our town. We'll fight for it. <laughs> Thanks, fellas. Now that that's settled, let's hustle on over to that Snake Gifts place. Yeah! yeah! Hmm, so I can hire one of them, probably. Defiant Stance. Don't know what that does. Mining. 
first aid. I think a healer would be nice. Let's work up a nice sweat. Let's go, Nikki. And I'm guessing I can only have one of you along, huh? Yep. All right. I could hire someone else, but I gotta take one of the boys, right? Let's go beat up some landowners. Oh, this chest's back. 500 leaves. Nothing here. Getting warmed up. Take this. Hmm. If we're lagging Here again. Get shot. Arrow up for two. All in a day's work. BP level up. I'm gonna get 30 JP in no time at this rate. Light Soul Stone, that's a nice pick-me-up. Hey, a customer! I'm just getting warmed up! <laughs> Bring it up! Arrow of Force! Got three JP off that. Time. Just keep shooting, just keep shooting. Uh, anything down here? As a matter of fact, there is. Inspiriting Plum. There's a bug flying around. Isn't that annoying? Uh, let's speed up a bit. Then can here? No. Howdy there, friend! Here goes! Arrow up for two. I'm just getting warmed up. Arrow up for two. Time to divvy up the earnings. They're cheating. And a level up. Well, I can get a skill. Hmm. Donate PP isn't really useful in this situation. I think I'll get Ember, get some fire damage going. Uh, it doesn't look like I can go here or here. So into the manse I go. Isn't this a very beautiful place? I can't wait to tear it down to smithereens. Ourselves a show now. Here goes. Nope. Bring it on. How does fire do here? Oh, he sets some firecrackers. Okay, that's interesting. I'm just getting warmed up. <laughs> Blow your top off. Arrow up for two. Two JP. Maybe next time. Up here, got a gold chest over there. And I bet I go around this way. Bronze shield. Oh, that gives me more HP. Nice. Uh, oh. Here goes. Take this. I'm just getting warmed up. Here. Yeah. Let's do it. Arrow up for. 
all in a day's work. I am acquiring JP at a breakneck base. Can I go inside that door, actually? I can. And there's some small silver ore. Aren't they quite the pickpockets? Oh. Maybe next time. Is there nothing in here? No, I don't see anything. No. There's nothing here. There appears to be a little golden chest here, though. A leather helm. You know, I appreciate it. I would like something that boosts my damage, but I don't think I'm getting it at this point. Okay, the customer. Yeehaw! Ice Sentinel. Hi! Just that Here comes Arrow of Fortune! Time to divvy up the earnings! Well, we have our merchant friend over here. A peddly boy. Partitio's hired helper can leverage their talents to provide a host of benefits, which can come in handy when visiting shops, like this one. The important thing is I have enough money to upgrade my weaponry. And my haggling is apparently saving me some leaves. Love to see it. Thanks, Nikki, my boy. Now let's go actually beat up the landowner. Any secrets behind here? Wishful thinking? Wishful thinking. Up we go! Did you see the tears on that fool's face earlier? <laughs> you said it, Gif! Excuse me, Gif. How you doing, buddy? Huh? Look who it is. I'm moved. I am. Came to give me what you owe me early? Huh. Something like that. I love the meaning in that. Here. A coin made from our silver. One measly leaf? You trying to insult me? As a matter of fact, I am. You're the one insulting it, you rotten scoundrel. Every fortune's made from a pile of these. The little guys. Treat one with contempt and you'll lose them all. That goes for money and for people. <laughs> what a joke. We've made up our minds, Gif. We're taking our town back. You? A third-rate merchant from the sticks? Ha! <laughs> You're just as stupid as your father. What did you say? The original owner of this plot of land retains the right to buy it back at any time they so please. That bit of fine print wasn't even in the original contract. It was forged. Oh, my God. The landowner slipped it in at a later date, all quiet-like. Your gullible idiot of a father never even noticed. Well, thanks for telling me. Thanks to you, we've lived fat off the hog. Earned ourselves a mine and a bunch of fool miners for next to nothing. Ha 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 ha!
Uh, let's pay him back, shall we? <sighs> oh yeah, baby. You're dirty through and through. You tricked my pops and stole everything from us. Yeah, well, too bad. This world, see? It's made so that people with smarts, like me, we win. You've done it. You really, really got my goat. Get ready, Gif. Because we're taking our town back from your dirty myths. Let's, Let's fucking do tussle, this. Gif. I'm just getting warmed up. So we've got two lackeys and the big man himself. Let's figure out weaknesses as we usually do. You first. Take this. You're laughing at me? How dare you? Okay. Here goes. This guy dies first. Hmm. I ain't one for holding back. What? Yeehaw! Oh, he has. He can speed buff his friends. Yeehaw! Let's do it. Shame this guy's incapacitated. He might have actually been living long enough to use it. Never mind, he does live long enough to use it. Hmm. Bring it on. Let's bring out our Healy boy. It's your shift now, friend. Take this. <laughs> He's laughing again. Oh, and debuffs? I'm just getting warmed up! Take this! Thank you kindly. Oh, I don't have to worry about healing anytime soon. <laughs> Let's get rid of you now. He's still alive? Are you kidding me? Take this! Sorry about that. Mm. Ah, <laughs> oh, he's buffing the other guy now. Bring it on. Go on, pump as much cash into them as you want. Let me get my SP back. Move on. I just really want this man to die already. Hmm. Off he goes. Hmm. He has not hit the Bring mark with his hit the mark at all. I'm just getting warmed up. Broke you. Oh, he's laughing again. Here goes. Ain't you a funny feller? Arrow of Thanks for that. I'm just getting warmed up. Hoo boy. Good effort. You still haven't hit me with that. Can't you try a little bit harder? All right. How sweet you try! I'm just getting warmed up. What if I just block? Bring it on. I'll pound you into lemonade. Bring it on. Hey, you finally hit the mark with hit the mark. Are you weak to lances? Yes, you are. 
Oh. I'm just getting warmed up. It's going to your shift now, friend. Take this. <laughs> Taking hits like a champ, man. I think I'm just immortal, so yeah. Oh, he gets some attacking too. Bring it on! I guess it's because my HP is full. Here's another shot. Take this! Oh never mind. Thanks for the help. Cool story, bud. Come on, that all you got? <laughs> Can't believe trash like you was giving me trouble. Hey, morons! Stop slacking off! Get over here and finish this fool! Mm. <laughs> now you call for help? Fine by me. I'll take you all on. Here goes. Looks like it's coming up soon. Take this! Bring it on! Bring it on! I'll pound you into lemonade! Here goes! Your obsession with lemonade needs to be studied, my dude. Hmm, taking some hits. Rotten little! Particio's latent power lets him instantly replenish his BP. I'm just getting warmed up. The bad news is I already have a ton of BP, so this wouldn't do anything. But I can heal myself off. Good effort. Here goes. Admittedly, this boss is not that difficult at all. Bring it on! But there's nothing wrong with pounding him to a pulp. I'm just getting warmed up. Get here. I don't think I even need to late I think he's just gone. Goodbye. Arrow of fortune. See you later. All in a day's work. 47 JP off of that. And a silver ingot. Now that stonks. Well now. Major peace. Wait! Spare my life! If it's money you want, I got it! Loads of it! See? Whoa there, silver. So this is where you've been hiding all the coin you swiped from us. We can rebuild our town with this. You won't blame me, right? I was just following orders. No, I think we'll blame you in every single capacity. That's so. Then fetch your boss. I'd like to have a word. I, I can't do that. No one's ever met him. Huh? Huh. Come to think of it, Pop said he handled the contract and all the negotiations by post. Neither me nor Pop's ever had a face-to-face. -face. So, Giff, who is this landowner anyway? You can't make me talk! It'll be my hide if I do! I think I'm gonna make you talk. Too bad for you. It'll be your hide if you don't. <laughs> Rock brilliant. The tycoon himself. You've gotta be shitting me. What? 
Mr. Rock. But, but why? The man's got a ruthless mind for business. This was his plan all along. You're lying. I knew he was a bad guy. This has to be some mistake. I'm sure of it. Mr. Rock could never do that to us. He wouldn't. Well, bad guy's a little too broad. Sleazeball. That's a good word for it. Well stocked. Life's returning to our little town. <laughs> hey, Greenhole, hurry up and move this material. Yes, sir. We're gonna work you hard until you pay off your debt. You hear? Whoop, my bad. Oh, uh, excuse me, Mr. Particio, sir. Hey, Pops, you fine to be walking around? Yeah, thanks to you. I'm too busy to be dead. <laughs> <laughs> I'm distributing the wealth stolen from us back to the townsfolk. And life's starting to come back to our time. Yeah, it sure is. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. I made arrangements to get the materials you wanted. Woo! You're a lifesaver. Mm -hmm. Hey, Partitio. Can we have a talk? Sure thing. Uh -huh. We're talking now, ain't we? Just be quiet and follow me for a spell, will you? Yes, Pop. It's been 16 years since we settled here. We started from nothing and had our fair share of ups and downs. Yeah, you could say that again. Pops, Mr. Rock, he, uh... I don't give a hoot about Rock no more, son. Mm -hmm. He left us in the lurch. I don't ever want to see his face again. Listen, I want you to look to the horizon. You've got a bright future ahead of you. You're gonna be something if I reckon right. Something too big for this little town to contain, even if it wanted to. Pops? Don't worry about us anymore. We can get along just fine without you. Hey, boys. Boss! Particio! Boss! You've got too much potential for our little town. It'd just go to waste here. That's why I want you to hit that dusty trail already. Get along, little chickadee. Uh, this town's my home. I grew up here. But to be honest, as the day is long, I've wanted to see the world for a while now. Ever since Mr. Rock took off and left us. Curiosity is a slow and insidious killer. I don't regret staying here, not for an instant. Wait, no, that was overconfidence. What am I thinking? But now, well, I know how painful poverty can be. Boss. I 
we managed to weather our troubles here, even if just barely. But somewhere out there, I know there's folks suffering just as much as we did, or worse. I want to do what I can for them. Use my talents to make the world a better place. Hmm. Mm. Being a merchant ain't just about making bundles of leaves. It's the reason why that matters. I'm proud of you, son. Oh, yeah. Ops. The theme coming in. You're no chickadee any longer. You're a full fledged, bona fide merchant. Go on. Help others like you helped us. Bring prosperity to all those troubled folks out there. And show up that rock feller while you're at it. Get along now, Particio. We'll see to the town while you're gone. Yeah, we'll keep it safe and sound. You guys, I wish you guys could see the smile on my face right now. Don't worry about us, boss. Boss, take care out there. Fellas. You all say so. I got no choice now, do I? I'm hitting the road. I'll be back once I eliminate that devil called poverty from the world. And he holds his head while he runs. That's cool. And so, with lofty ambitions stirring deep within his breast, Particio leaves his hometown behind. Untold thousands across the world suffer under the yoke of poverty. And he has vowed to friends and family to help them all. Onwards, this young merchant strides with eager step, excited by the prospect of discovering what's over that distant horizon. Bravo! I'm looking forward to sharing a campfire with you. Hmm. Party's full. Mm, I could slot you in the place of throwing me for a bit. I dare say at this point, I think I'm gonna call it here once I find the safe point. Hey, Pap. I guess, since we can, we'll figure out what he's about before we call it. Particio's father. He left his drunken, abusive father at the age of 8, set up his own shop at the age of 16, but lost it all in a fire when he was 24. After that, he met Rock and started a new business, which earned him a fortune. He had Particio when 30, he was 32, and lost his wife just before turning 40. That was very helpful. That lets me hire the residents of the town for fewer leaves. Neat. Well, we beat up the landowners. Well, that's it. That's all you need to know. We beat up the landowners. That's a happy ending for everyone, right? Next time on Octobath 2. We get ambushed by this side quest. The Scent of Commerce. This is a story starring Particio who has caught the Scent of Commerce. There is no need to travel every path before him, but doing so may aid you in your travels. So hold on. Aha. Uh -huh. So we got another side quest on our hands. A very big side quest, apparently. But next time on Octopath 2, we go and meet the final Traveler and assemble the eight. See you guys then.